Hello everyone, this is Rare Puncture, and we're taking a look at Star Trek Online again. This is the Tier 6 Veteran Reward Ship for the Klingon. The ship you can get for being Lifetime Subscriber or Thousand Day Player. The Dove Q Class Heavy Destroyer. It looks a little, uh, pretty much the same as the... Uh, the tier 5 version, although it, it looks a little meaner, I think. I think it's kind of the better looking ones of the uh, veteran ships. Also has the regenerative mode and tactical mode. With the... Here you can get the Disruptor Lotus and the regenerative mode having the Tachyon Inversion Beam. looks kind of it's got the little neon tubes going on there but it's all right they look a little big but Klingons don't do anything small do they all right so for hit points it starts at 39,675 at level 50 and 46,000 at level 60 which is the same as the uh, Federation one, I think it's also the same as the Romulan. Take a look at the ship here. You can see there's four forward weapons and there's three aft weapons. There's five tactical consoles, three engineering, two science, and then there's the special console with the, allows the changing of the modes with also plus 3.3% hull and plus 12% crit severity, which the tier 5 one doesn't have. And we'll go through the tiers here. Tier 1, with the 5% accuracy. That for the crit severity, plus 15% crit severity. The plus 2.5% crit chance. The plus 10 to energy and kinetic weapons. And the Star Trip trait, the weapon system synergy, where every time you activate the weapons, energy weapons it adds to the stack and then you get to 10 and then it adds 25 percent damage and 50 percent shield bleed through for the next torpedo attack which is nice if you're running torpedoes has a base hull of 750 base turn rate of 14 so it's pretty maneuverable has plus 10 weapon power, plus 5 shield power. We're going to see it in, in motion. Bridge officers, there's a commander tactical, a lieutenant commander engineering slash command, a lieutenant science, then there's the Lieutenant Commander Universal and Ensign Universal, which are always nice. We can see the ship moving around, going in circles. The shield modifier is poor on this with the 0.833% or 0.833, but makes up for it with the battle cloak, I think, because they think the Federation one has 0.9 shield. But here we'll take a look at the shield, the Tachyon version beam, where we, it's like a shield heal. Here we're getting our ass kicked in crystal. But we're going to take a look at the Disruptor Lotus, which everyone is probably here for.
and the weapon test is done. All right, here's some Disruptor Lotus porn for you. Enjoy. Alright, well that's going to end this video. If you like this, give us a like and subscribe. And we'll see you guys again. Goodbye.